Hi guys, we are at one of my favorite places in the world, Cane's, and we're about to order the ladies standing outside, like Chick-fil-A, so we have to do this like right now. Hi, Steph. Could I do the three finger combo um, with the, could I do the pink Post Malone cup? Yeah, of course, what's your? Uh, I'll just do a water. And then on, with my toast, could I get it toasted on both sides? Yeah. And then could I? Sorry. Oh, you're fine. And then could I also do um, one of the bigger size cups of cane sauce? Sure. Else? That's all. Okay, so I have a three finger combo with a post one cup with the water in it, and then butter both sides of your toast, and a 30 ounce cup of cane sauce. Yep. Thank you. That would be seventeen fifty for you can cash your card. Card. It's perfect. I can cash it right here. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. So, sorry that was like a really quick intro, but. They have a new Post Malone cup. I saw it on Instagram and it's pink and it has like his cute little cartoon on it. You guys will see it. It's like funny. So I called this morning and I'm like, do you guys have the Post Malone cup? <laughs> I'm like the I'm like one of those people that calls like McDonald's and Canes, all of that. I'm like, do you guys have this new item? And they're like, why are you calling? Like, I wonder if like lots of people call or it's like just me. But yeah, they said they just got it in. It's limited time, limited edition, only for today, I believe, or until supply runs out. So excited. I do like Post Malone. I've seen him in concert a couple times. So I just like the cup because it's cute and it says canes on it and it's pink. So we got a lot of sauce as well because I haven't done that in a while. So uh, maybe I should have did the four finger. Maybe I should have. Like to have a little extra with the sauce at home. But I do use the sauce for literally everything. You guys, it's so good on a salad. <laughs> like, I love making homemade Big Mac salad bowls. And I just do like ground beef warm with melted cheese on top. And I put that on top of the lettuce. And I know so I got comments before where it's like, ew. Like, hot lettuce like that's so gross I'm like it's literally like a burger but okay so I do ground beef with cheese and then lettuce pickles sometimes banana peppers then I make like a Big Mac sauce like in and out sauce and um, what else I think that's like it oh sometimes diced onion and diced tomato too so it makes like a good Big Mac bowl sometimes you just don't want the bun and sometimes I just don't have a bun so I'll do that but like if you do it with canes and add like grilled chicken on top try it with some cheese mmm so good so I always do use the leftover sauce you could really dip anything in it I wish I could get like a small size cup of it she said 32 ounce. I thought there was two sizes, but I wasn't sure. But I think 32 ounce is like the biggest, the biggest size you can get. <laughs> I think that's like a large cup, so. Gonna have lots of sauce. Is this 32 ounces? I feel like it might be. Look how cute this little flower is. It's a straw cap. It's so sunny, you can't even like see it. Look how cute. My mom gave it to me. It's like adorable and definitely just for the accessory because like why do you need to cover your straw? I'm not sure. <laughs> so bugs don't get in it. <laughs> like at nighttime. Here's your drink. Thank you. Here's that sauce. Be careful Awesome, thanks. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you, you have a great day. You too. We got a cup of sauce. So I have some updates I wanna tell you guys and then I also asked for a Q&A on my Instagram. I haven't looked at any of the questions yet but we can go through some of those and answer as well. I'm surprised I have this much energy to be honest because I went to bed at five in the morning. Okie dokie. 
so hungry so yeah i was up super late last night because hershey had a stomach ache she's going to the vet today i'm glad they got her in it's like for an emergency um she was doing fine this morning but she was up all night like like shaking and also like she threw up a couple times and then was like going outside and using the bathroom and then I noticed some blood so we called the vet this morning and they're getting us in in two more hours but she seemed fine like she ate a treat and stuff and like she's acting normal playing with toys and stuff so I don't know but she's st Ooh. oh wait what is this ketchup oh it's ketchup I thought it was hot sauce this is a cute little hot sauce I just said hot ketchup look how cute these ketchup packets are this one says Colorado this one says Kansas and this one is also Colorado. That's kind of cute. Oh yeah, let's look at the cup that we came here for. Oh my gosh, look how cute. So if you scan the QR code, you see like if you win. But like, isn't that cute? I really like it. <laughs> so worth it. I love like limited edition stuff like that. Oh, she put it down as my name is Seth. <laughs> Seth. Ah. <laughs> Sometimes it's like hard to hear Steph and like I say like Stephanie because of that because it sounds like Seth I guess. Do I look like a Seth? Raising canes. So I got the toast buttered on both sides. Check that out. Oh, gorgeous. Before we continue on with the video, you guys know how much I love HelloFresh. So I want to tell you guys a little bit about it. And also I have a discount for you guys too at the end. So I get HelloFresh weekly and I choose all the meals every single week. So I'm always switching up what I'm eating and making and learning how to cook new things. So on this week's menu, I chose to have pork stir fry. Yum. This I love. I get this one a lot. This is the Monterey Jack unfried chicken. Mmm, so good. And then this is a Tex-Mex beef and pepper enchilada so fun i want to make that today so with fall being right around the corner hellofresh is here to help you plan for the busy season ahead with tasty meals delivered right to your doorstep so all you have to do is simply choose what meals you'd like and the delivery date of your choice then you can lay back and relax and enjoy the last days of summer knowing your dinner is covered this fall we all have places to be and standing in the checkout line is definitely not one of them just leave the meal planning and the grocery shopping all to HelloFresh. You save so much time with the easy step-by-step -step instructions and all the pre-portioned ingredients. It makes dinner time or lunch so easy. Because who doesn't love a homemade wholesome meal but sometimes don't want to spend hours going grocery shopping and cooking it? But with HelloFresh, all you need is 15 minutes and you'll be enjoying a tasty and satisfying meal made in your kitchen, all homemade. Just look for their quick and easy dinner options, plus quick breakfasts and lunches too. You guys don't wanna miss out on this great deal that I have for all of you. You can use code 50 Pappas at hellofresh.com for 50% off and free shipping. Once you guys see how this meal's gonna look, you're gonna want it. This is my first time ever making enchiladas. Look how pretty these look. Now we're adding on our homemade enchilada sauce. Okay, the enchiladas are done. Look how pretty these look. So let's see how I did. Mmm. That's so good. So again, use my link down below and use code 50 Steph Pappas for 50% off and free shipping. Yum, I am so excited. Let's take a thumbnail. Dipping into our cup of sauce. Mm. I always like to start off with the toast because it's like my favorite. Let's do a big dip. Yum. Mmm, look at that. Mmm. So good. I always forget to ask for it to be double buttered. Do it. Next time you guys get canes, do it and let me know what you think. So good. I always like eat the whole piece of bread right away. I'm gonna try and like eat it slowly. Have some chicken. Ooh, these are like burning hot. Mmm. Seriously, so good so good so hopefully Hershey is okay 
um i'll like give you guys an update but yeah, i'm not i'm not sure like because she is not one to like eat things in the yard And she only had dog food yesterday and like a couple treats that like she's had before so I'm not sure but I was googling stuff last night and then it was like freaking me out but she just had to go like outside to use the bathroom like a lot like she kept getting up and I could tell like she wasn't comfortable because she wasn't sleeping and usually she like sleeps all throughout the night and like is such a big sleeper so we will see hopefully she's okay she was seeming like she seemed fine this morning and like she wanted breakfast but the vet said don't give her anything, so I didn't. Besides a treat. Um, but I just got back from New York this weekend. I went on like a random last minute little weekend trip. I'm trying to travel more. I always say I want to travel, so I'm like, I'm doing it. I want to like do more things and then I also like told myself this year like if someone asked me to do something I'm going to like try and say yes like just say yes to everything even if I'm tired or even like if I it's like something I don't really usually want to do like I want to make memories and I want to live life so I have been like doing that and being spontaneous which it's been a lot of fun so I'm glad I am doing that Like, just to take a little 24-hour trip, or just over the weekend. So spontaneous and fun. <laughs> Especially, like, places like that, I feel like just if you go for a weekend or just a day, like, it is worth it. Like, you don't need to be there any longer. Mmm, so good. water down my shirt so when I was in New York they had so much live music and I love live music I love watching like bland bands play instruments and sing and it made me decide that I want to learn how to play guitar so I ordered a pink guitar I got the amp and everything I need and I'm going to teach myself. My brother is really good at guitar. He taught himself as well. Probably, when was that? Because it was when he was in college. So probably, shoot, I, I don't know. It's been a while. Over five years. But he's very good now. And he taught himself how to play. And I love like Red Hot Chili Peppers and like music like that. So I'm gonna try and learn one of the Red Hot Chili Peppers songs. Maybe my brother can help me out a little bit. But I don't know, I just want like a hobby. So we're gonna learn how to play guitar. And I think I might like stream it on Twitch, like every time I try and play, like just do a little stream and just like practice. So I'm so excited for my guitar to come. I had to get a pink one and I'm probably going to have to get my nails cut down. <laughs>
because they're long at least this hand I'll just get them all trimmed down because these are my natural nails and I broke one off like a couple weekends ago so you could see like my natural nail nails there she had to put like a tip on it so I feel like it's good to just get them all cut down and like start fresh and I don't know how short they have to be to play guitar I feel like I feel like they'll have to be pretty short I don't know oh it's gonna be hard I know it's gonna be so hard and like I'm like the type of person to like start something and then like stop it <laughs> like I say oh I'm gonna start sewing or I'm gonna start doing this and then like I get all the things to do it and then like I just don't do it especially with like reading books I always buy books and say I'm gonna read it and I don't But this, I'm actually gonna do it. I'm saying it now. I'm gonna learn how to play guitar. <laughs> I think it'll be fun to like stream it too and like we all just like learn together. But let's answer some of these questions. Are you a pad or a tampon girly? I am a tampon girly <laughs> and then like a pad girly at nighttime. When I first started my period though, I only wore pads. I was scared to try tampons for like a while. I was young though. I got my period when I was 12. What's your favorite luxury brand and why? I would definitely say Louis Vuitton and because I think it's the nicest quality. What is your type in men? I don't know if I really have it. Like physical type, I definitely like brunettes. Definitely brunettes. And... Maybe like lighter eyes, like a hazel, light brown, like eyes like that. I like facial hair, I like tattoos, and someone that's like bigger. Personality, I would just say someone who is funny outgoing very kind to like waiters and things like that like I absolutely hate when like people like don't say thank you and stuff like I hate that <laughs> and uh, I would say someone who has like big goals and is it lazy I feel like those are some big ones I like like goals and someone who like sticks with their word How was your New York trip? Super fun. The food was all amazing. I had like the best vodka pasta. And then I had this homemade pesto basil gnocchi. Oh my gosh, it was like the yummiest thing. I had like pasta every single day. And then the pizza, I had a vodka pasta pizza it had vodka sauce all over it with rigatoni noodles oh so good and i had a new york bagel for the first time everything was just delicious like the food was amazing and i it, it was definitely a lot nicer than what i remembered when i went when i was younger like it was actually very clean and i don't know i liked it a lot i had fun there i could never live there though i I was excited to come back home and like drive on the streets with no traffic <laughs> and just see a bunch of grass. How do you stay positive? I'd say that 
just life isn't that serious and just have fun and stay positive because you never know how long you have on earth or what could happen don't get mad so easily because why let that waste your energy and time there's no point at all just enjoy it while you're here do you wish to have kids and if yes what age you're planning if no why I w yes I would like to have kids in the future not anytime soon maybe when I'm like closer to 30 I would say but I mean it all depends when I get married and like things like that because I want to have kids after I get married and not right away either because I want to like travel and which I mean you still can with kids but I don't know I definitely do want kids though at least like two maybe three I don't have any names picked out either. I know like lots of people have like a ton of names like listed down in their phone. I have nothing. <laughs> I don't really know. I just haven't been around many babies. Like my one friend had a baby and that was like the first baby I feel like I've held. I have a little cousin. Yeah, I don't know. I just haven't held that many babies and like they're just so fragile. It's like scary. <laughs> Like, I have not been around that many kids or anything. Like, lots of people, like, babysit growing up and stuff. I don't know. Like, I feel like if I was around them more growing up, I'd maybe have more of, like, a baby fever, but I don't. <laughs> Whatever happens, happens. But one day. One day I will. And I would love to vlog it, too. <laughs> Will you be getting another puppy? No, 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 no. I will not be. <laughs> have you ever broken a bone? I have not. I have like twisted my ankle from doing cheerleading, but no, I've never broken anything. So good. I'm so glad I got this cup. It has just like a plastic lid on it though. I wish it had like an actual lid. It keeps like falling off. That's why I've been drinking out of my Stanley cup. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I am very full, so I'm going to cut the video off here. But if you enjoyed it, please give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Let me know if you guys want to see me do a video asking the employees what to eat again and where I should do it at. But I love you all so much, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.